Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today, we will be sharing tips and tricks for getting a good sleep on an airplane. Falling asleep on a plane can be a challenge for most of us, but with these simple tips, you'll be able to catch some Z's on board. As a frequent traveler, I know all too well the struggle of trying to get some shut eye on an airplane. The cramped seats, the bright lights and the background noise can make it nearly impossible to fall asleep. But after years of trial and error, I've discovered some little-known tricks that have revolutionized my in-flight sleeping experience. I remember my first long-haul flight and how I tossed and turned in my seat, unable to get comfortable. I was exhausted by the time I landed, and it took me days to fully recover. That's when I started my quest to find the perfect solution for sleeping on an airplane. I experimented with different types of neck pillows, noise-canceling headphones, and even sleep aids. But what I found to be the most effective was a simple combination of several small techniques. From blocking out light with a sleep mask, to choosing the right seat, to breathing exercises, I've learned how to fall asleep fast and stay asleep for the duration of the flight. And the best part! I arrive feeling refreshed and ready to tackle the day. In this video, I will be sharing my top tips and tricks for getting a good sleep on an airplane. So, sit back, relax, and get ready to learn the secrets to sleeping like a baby on your next flight. Trust me, your future self will thank you. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell notification icon to keep up with the most recent airline and hotel deals and discounts. The best time for a flight is at night, when you normally sleep. Try to wake up two to three hours earlier on the day of your flight to help you fall asleep faster on board. Also, arrive at the airport a couple of hours in advance to avoid unnecessary stress. Do everything you normally do before going to bed like brushing your teeth and reading a book. This will trick your body into thinking it's just another regular day. The best days to fly are Tuesdays and Wednesdays, as they are the least crowded days. You might even get up to three seats to yourself, or the flight crew might be able to move you to a quieter place. Avoid flying on Fridays or the days before holidays, as they are the most fully loaded flights. Always try to pick a window seat for the best sleep. If you normally sleep on your left side, aim for a seat on the left, and if you sleep on your right side, aim for a seat on the right. To avoid noise, avoid the front part of the plane and the seats near the compartment wall. Pick the seats over the wings for a stable flight. Wear loose clothes made of natural materials for a comfortable sleep. Bring a jacket and warm socks if your airline doesn't provide blankets, as it can get cold in the cabin. Avoid wearing clothes that constrict your movement, but you can fasten your seatbelt over your clothes to prevent flight attendants from waking you up during turbulence. Tilt your seat back as far as it will go to minimize the pressure on your spinal discs. Rest your legs on your carry-on or place a pillow under your knees. Avoid leaning against the seat in front of you, as it's bad for your neck and spine, and also not very polite to the person sitting in front of you. We hope these tips will help you have a sound nap on your next flight. Make sure you watch the upcoming video and check out the link below this video to get a special discount. It's an amazing offer that you won't want to miss. Hurry, this offer won't last long. Click the link now to get your exclusive discount and save big on your next trip.